spilled my water this morning all over the floor. So that's a shirt soaking it up right now. <laughs> This is gonna be like my standard breakfast that I have almost every day. I was eating uh, oatmeal, so a quick one minute oats were really good to have. Um, the only problem is if you eat them for two years straight, it just gets kind of old. Um, you can cook them overnight, leave them in the fridge, and in the morning it's a better consistency, but when you have these every single day, it's a little bo uh, boring. So if you try cream of wheat, it's a good replacement. Um, there's like plain flavor, there's chocolate, there's multiple kinds you can use. Um, you can also put peanut butter. Another thing too is if this is too hard to stir, you can always use PB2, it's just powder peanut butter get on Amazon or you like like a nutri shop or something like that. 28 grams per container so it's a big breakfast it's good to have after you train and I take a little bit of protein powder and that gives you more volume so it's not just a small packet I'll have a few strawberries maybe two or three also I'll drink a big chug of these uh, liquid egg whites. And if you buy these, make sure you buy the ones that you can actually drink. Some of them you can't, you can only cook with them, you can't drink them. I wake up at like 5.30 to 6 a.m. depending on how I feel. Sometimes I wake up at like 6.15. I used to eat like eggs and sausage and you know, a big breakfast. And what happened was when I go to train, I was too full. I do almost like half fasted training. Um, so the medicine that I have to take for my vertigo you have to take it with food um, and it's just like if you don't take it without any food your stomach really hurts and it hurts your head so if you have any kind of substance in your stomach it helps a ton so I'll eat half a quest bar basically just half of this and there's still half left and then when I get back from the workout I can eat that as a good carb and protein source I do drink a gallon of water a day so I have a gallon jug always on my desk. I have like two or three in my office at all times. I have a bunch here. You just wanna make sure that with whatever you do that you're consistent. You can implement that into everything. You know, your work, your relationships, you know, you're working out, your work, your career. So far, so good. Um, just trying to prepare for the whole consistent thing. I've done 175 vlogs in my life so far and now 300 this year to come. And we are back in the office for 2017. Sorry if I have a little bit of a lisp. I have white strips on right now. I'm gonna open up shop. It's supposed to rain again, hopefully. Well, not hopefully, but it's supposed to rain again in a few days, which not really sure how I feel about that. This is GoPro that has to come in. That's my lunch. This is my camera gear. Zip that up. I gotta clean out my car soon, too. Lunch. I had no idea this car was even here. I don't even know what the deal is on this car. It's a nice looking Aventador, that's for sure. Now the hardest part is about the car industry right now, at least for me today, is that I guess it's a holiday of some sort, New Year's Reserve. Whoops. I have a bunch of deals working right now on different cars and I can't get anything funded. I'm trying to get wire transfers, I'm trying to submit applications. Come on, banks, I wanna make money. So, uh, let's get the day started. Motor Society hats are gonna be on sale soon. We're doing some special deals. I brought these in to do some promotional photos today for just like around the shore and stuff like that. This is the GoPro that I bought for myself for my birthday a few days ago, so I'm gonna do an unboxing today. Charge that up and try to get it to work. Custom tune from Evolve Tuning for my M3. It gets installed tomorrow. think 258 people to respond to on my timeline for saying happy birthday so I'm actually gonna go through pretty much all of them and say thank you hello hey. how are you good you have any questions today Alex Alex Spencer nice to meet you nice sir. to meet you too just thinking Monday morning you had to Oh, hell yeah, dude. Yeah, I'm on. Oh, I see you, dude. <laughs> yes, yes. 
<laughs> what are the chances of this, dude? Seriously, dude. That was the weirdest timing that I called you, oh. and you're like, oh, hey, yeah, I'll be there in two seconds. Anyway, what up, dude? Up, dude. Good. Oh, let me see that watch real quick. Dude, happy birthday. Let me see the watch. Oh, thanks, dude. Nice. Move, move. All right, dude. Out of here. Adios. I'll see you Friday. Adios. Later. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hit the RV. Mouse. Mouse. <laughs> Oh yeah? yeah? Spencer. Okay. So running? On a Lumix camera, huh? On a Lumix GH4 with a 13, I believe. No, 12 hey, to 35 man. lens. Front. I've seen that. I used to I bought one of those one time for an SLR, but it was a it was a kind of a crappy quality one. Ah, yeah. And I took it back, and I'd rather have like the legit setup like that. I had four or five different people come in today who knew me through YouTube. That's so rad. I'm gonna pull this car out for some photographers that are here that wanna shoot some video. If it starts raining, just run in and let me know. Oh yeah, yeah of course. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, have fun. Take your time. All right. Yep. Tight squeeze. I love those guys shoot this thing, so make sure both doors are closed. Yeah. So I don't know if it's gonna be raining anymore or what the deal is, but I'm gonna go throw this back inside. But you know what, actually, I need to get some photos for Instagram really quick. This guy's for sale too. All the pricing and info is right there on the screen. I'm seriously so spoiled because I am freezing cold right now. Today's like one of those days where I'm back in the office and I guess today's a holiday which I had honestly no idea. So I'm just like trying to, I don't know, I'm so tired and I'm so sore and like my body hurts and my head hurts and I don't know, I'm just like, Mondays are always the hardest. I love Mondays because I get to get back to work and be busy, but at the same time, it's like I'm so, I wonder how many times I said like. That's a dude that was in my vlog for my birthday. What's up, dude? What up, bro? How are you? Good, what's going on? I honestly don't get cold that often, but like, my hands are freezing today. Just finishing up some stuff at work right now. Never had a chance to open this, only because today was just really busy being back in the office. It's funny because I th almost thought that Corvette was a 599 or like an F12. It looks so much like one. From far away, it looks, it definitely has an F12 look to it. 
I just made a Facebook post and an Instagram post about looking for a car. I'm currently looking for a McLaren P1 with a little bit higher mileage. So when I say higher mileage, somewhere between like 3,000 to 5,000 to 6,000 miles. I'm also looking for a silver or yellow or any other color LaFerrari. So if you know of any cars for sale, any hyper cars, my email is right here, cash buyer. Um, we want to stick with US cars, so please just shoot me a message or an email or anything. We're looking for cars. And not only that, but if you have anything else for sale, we're always looking to buy anything. So this this is bugging me. I, I'm, I don't like this. I just realized too, I never showed our yellow 911R. I'll do a short film on this tomorrow. I like this one a lot. I like the ones with stripes a little bit better. There was someone who came in here with his kid. If you're watching this video, please email me because I did not get your contact info. I saw you having your eyes on this car for a while. So this is the tuning kit for my M3. These are my cutouts. Those are my stainless steel brake lines. Those are my pads. And those are my brake rotors for this car. So big, big, big day tomorrow for the M3. Ain't, ain't no mercy. Ain't, ain't, ain't no mercy.